Hello all. In this video, we're going to talk about how to find the determinant of the 2 by 2 matrix. So let's start off first by looking at the definition of a determinant. A determinant is a number that is associated with a square matrix. And a square matrix is a matrix with the same number of rows and columns. So let's take a look at first off the square matrix. In this matrix, we have two rows and two columns, and we designate that as a two by two matrix. The first number are the number of rows you have. The second number is the number of columns you have. Since we have the same number of rows and columns in this matrix, it is a square matrix, and therefore we can take the determinant of it. And this one has three rows and three columns, so we designate it as a three row by three column matrix, rows, columns again. Make sure that you always write your rows before your columns, it's important. All right, so both of these are square matrices and we can take determinants of both of these. Remember, a determinant can only be taken on a square matrix. All right, so let's talk about the definition of, um, of how to take the determinant of a two by two matrix. So if you have a two by two matrix, whoops, A, B, C, D, and this I know is a matrix because I surround my two by two matrix with square brackets. I noticed some of you in your homework and on the test dropped these little hooks at the end and made them straight lines. They can't be dropped because it means something else in math. You have to put your matrix in between square brackets. If we want to take the determinant of a square matrix, it looks like this. The determinant of matrix A, B, C, D, that is also equivalent to this, A, B, C, D, in between two straight lines, this means right here, take the determinant of the square matrix A, B, C, D. And you can see why you cannot drop these little hooks at the end, because if you do, it means to take the determinant of the matrix. Um, so please make sure that you use the square brackets when you're talking about a matrix. Use the straight lines when you're talking about a determinant. To take the determinant of a two by two matrix, it is a simple process, A times D minus B times C. And the answer can be a positive number, a negative number, and even zero. So let's do a couple of examples of taking the determinant of a two by two matrix. Let me get rid of these arrows so I can fit my examples on my page. All right. So let's take the determinant, I'm going to write it in two different ways. The determinant of the matrix, let's say negative 2, 9, 4, and negative 18. That is also written as negative 2, 9, 4, and negative 18 in between straight lines. It means the same thing. So let's find the determinant using this formula right here. So negative 2 times negative 18 minus 9 times 4, which is 36, minus 36, which is 0. The determinant of this matrix is 0. Let's go ahead and do another example. The determinant of 3, 5, negative 1, and 7. That can also be written as the determinant of 3, 5, negative 1, and 7, which equals 3 times 7 minus negative 1 times 5, which is 21 plus, I mean, I wrote 27 when I said 21. 21 plus 5, which is a total of 26. So you can see here, in one example, we got zero as the determinant. 
In another example, we got 26 as the answer of a determinant. Okay, so that is how you take the determinant of a 2 by 2 matrix.